way more than just some class you go to, you know. There's memories and bonds that will last lifetimes. We all have that favorite teacher from high school, right? Well, this morning, dozens of students and former students were in St. George to say goodbye to theirs. 57-year-old Morgan Hager died of a heart attack just a week ago. He served 25 years in the Air Force and another 10 years as the instructor of the Air Force Junior ROTC program at Dixie High School. Now, Morgan could have had a full military funeral, but as new specialist Alex Cabrera reports, his family had another idea. What up? What? Military funerals what a guard. come with all the pomp and circumstance they deserve. Privilege and an honor to be invited here today. For Senior Master Sergeant Morgan Hager's funeral in St. George this morning was no different. That is, until you looked at those in uniform performing the service and realizing they're so young. Loved his cadets, his cadets loved him. You see, after 25 years in the Air Force, Hager could have had a funeral involving current military members. However, for the past 10 years, he was an instructor for Dixie High School's Air Force Junior ROTC program, so his family figured, why not let his students do the service? That they were more important to him, it meant more to him than nationally being done. Talk about an assignment where these cadets wanted a perfect score. Being able to perform military honors. Um, for Cadet Connor Burns. For a man like Sergeant Hager is... Hager was like a father. It's amazing. Even former students came back. This is a once in a lifetime you know, opportunity to be able to perform this kind of service for someone that you love and care about and you cherish. And though this service marked the end of Hager's time in this world, we were honored to be a part of it. There's no doubt he lives on in others. He would be so proud. Alex Cabrero, KSL 5 News. Alex, great story. Thank you.